All right, so the product of the page numbers on the two faces facing pages of a book is 132, so find the page numbers. So that means two pages are sequential, so I'm just going to make something up. These these aren't the so this isn't the solution, but like, you know, page like 54 and uh I like page 55. So like they're two sequential pages, but um the product of them equals 132. All right, so cancel this out. So I'm going to do X and then times it's times something. So it's going to be X plus one because it's the next page over is equal to 132. So what we do is we distribute, we get X squared plus X equals 132, but I'm going to move the 132 over and then I get zero. All right. So I'm going to use the quadratic formula plus or minus, or excuse me, opposite of B plus or minus the square root of B squared minus four AC all over 2a. Um, so we're going to have uh, opposite of b is to give me negative 1 plus or minus square root of uh, 1 squared, just 1, so minus 4 times 1 times negative 132. All over, it's a really large number, all over 2 times 1, so just 2. Okay, so what we end up getting that's a crazy number. Um, all right, so I calculated it's 529. So we get negative one plus or minus square root of 529. Uh, everything that's in there. All right, which is uh, 23. Divide by two, so we end up with uh, negative 22 over two. Oh no, that's not right, negative 24. And we get 22 over 2. Okay, so we end up with negative 12 and 11. So it can only be the positive solution. So it ends up being 11. But of course, that's 4x. But then sequentially, it's just 12. So 11 and 12. And 11 times 12 is equal to 132. This is something you could actually probably brute force on a calculator. But it's still good to know how to do it. All right. I hope this helped you out. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.